A single bench in Ditmas Park has become the talk of the neighborhood after the builder received a code violation. CBS 2's Natalie Dudridge reports some say it's beneficial as a gathering place, others say it encourages loitering. I mean, it's cool. It looks, it looks nice. As this brightly colored public bench was being built over the last few weeks at the corner of Marlboro Road and Newkirk Avenue, it started gaining lots of attention. Most of it good. It's decorative. It's brightening up what's dull around here. You can sit, you can talk with a friend. But some of the feedback, not so good. It's a four out of ten. It's not really comfortable. In certain places, like, it's going to have people, like, sleeping on it, like, and resting, and, yeah, you probably get stuck, like, kids could play and get stuck on it. The bench designer, Michael Coombs, was commissioned by the Flatbush Development Corporation. He invited the neighborhood to take part, but before it was even complete... A DOT violation came to the landlord, saying that we had 30 days to remove the bench, and I was, you know, heartbroken. Coombs was told he didn't have the right permits, and there were some safety issues. One of the concerns was that uh, it could be unsafe for small children, so I put blue blocks in between the biggest rungs. Now some community members and local businesses, including at this deli, are rallying to keep it. It's actually better on our end because people who grab their breakfast and their coffee, they can come sit down. I don't think it needs to be taken down, no. The Department of Transportation got back to us about the violation, saying in part... We'll reach out to the Flatbush Development Corporation and work with them to determine if the bench can be approved by the city to remain in place. I did it for our neighbors. I did it for our neighborhood. You know, um, we did it together, and it's such a beautiful thing that is about supporting one another. Support our bench supports. Coombs said he's already been asked to build another nearby, but now he's learned before construction can go ahead, there must be approvals through the correct city channels, or you'll get benched. In Ditmas Park, Brooklyn, Natalie Dudridge, CBS 2 News.